Hi everyone, I'm Jeremy Wells, CEO of WISPA. I'd like to take you through our results for the first half of the 2020 financial year, the six months to the 31st of December 2019. Our strong performance over this period reaffirms that we're on track to deliver our FY20 prospectus forecasts. We achieved or outperformed our key metrics in line with our year-end targets. WISPA continues to execute on our growth strategy supported by new customer growth within Australasia and Asia and increased use of our platform by existing customers. WISPA is a software as a service or a SaaS communication workflow platform that automates interactions between businesses and people. We simplify the management of an organisation's communications processes and we help organisations improve their communications with our automated workflow that can push out engaging communications at scale to stakeholders, no matter where they are. This ensures stakeholders receive accurate, timely and useful information that's pertinent to them through the channels those stakeholders prefer to use. Things like personalised SMS, email, video or WhatsApp. The need for our services is universal. Everyone from airlines to government authorities to retail brands use us. We're now producing 1.5 billion interactions between our 500 blue chip customers and their 55 million unique stakeholders each year. Because we're a SaaS company, the key for us is our annualised recurring revenue. We generate revenue primarily through recurring subscription licences and recurring transactional charges. Once customers begin using our software, we typically become embedded within their business processes. Over the last 10 years, we've expanded the revenue generated from our existing customer base. In the first half of the financial year, we've increased customer recurring revenue retention to 116% indicating that most of our customers expand the use of our product over time. And our total annualised recurring revenue is now 36.7 million. This is an increase of 16% on the previous financial year and up 22% from this time last year. On a per customer level, our average recurring revenue is up 17% to 72,100 compared to the prior corresponding period. We also achieved or outperformed our other key metrics. Half yearly revenues of 18.2 million were up 20% on the same period last year. Recurring revenue is more than 95%, providing future revenue surety. EBITDA is 25% or 1.6 million ahead of our IPO prospectus forecast, predominantly driven by the timing of operating expense. Gross margin of 62% is stable when on track to achieve prospectus forecast, and the lifetime value of our customer base is now at 222 million, up 26% since the end of the last financial year. The results we've announced here can only be achieved by the great teamwork and the innovation of our people here at WISPA. So thank you to our incredible staff. Thank you to our partners and our customers for the trust that you place in us every day. And finally, thank you to our shareholders for joining us on the WISPA journey. We really believe that when organisations engage with people effectively, value is created.